broken at Christmas. Merry Christmas. It's only a week away until we all celebrate the birth of the Lord Jesus Christ. On my prayer walk this morning, I've been pondering songs of Christmas. Do you know the Bible reveals to us that music has always been a part of the celebration of the birth of our Lord Jesus Christ? You recognize in the story found in the Gospel of Luke, Mary. In fact, we often refer to Mary's song as Mary's song. It'll be celebrated and sung throughout our region. In fact, around the world. But did you know when God's Spirit came upon Zechariah and he began to prophesy? That's right, he did it in song. Mary's song, Zechariah's song. And of course, the angels from heaven came down and they, in the field where the shepherds were, began to sing. But it's the story after the angels sang that we read with the birth of the Lord Jesus Christ that the shepherds were returned back singing and praising and glorifying Almighty God. And that's the reason why I've been focused on my morning prayer walk about the brokenness of our hearts and our lives. I was thinking of the song that was inspired over two hundred years ago. It was in a small village in Austria. There had been a horrific storm and the flood that came as a result of the storm destroyed the church organ. It needed to be repaired. It was Christmas Eve and there was no music to be sung. They asked the clergy, John Moore, if he would write a song just for Christmas Eve. And again, the organ would not play. He would write the words to the song Silent Night, inspired by the shepherds in the field. That's right, from the story found in the Gospel of Luke, John Moore would write these words. Silent night, holy night, all is calm, all is bright. Round yon virgin, mother for child, holy infant, so tender and mild. Sleep in heavenly peace, sleep in heavenly peace. These words to this song were the results of a horrific storm that destroyed the church organ. Oh, your life is not destroyed. We have setback and brokenness in all of our lives. Things that hurt us and wound us. Things that frustrate us, discourage us. But God puts a song within our heart. The world was filled with sin and darkness. And the Lord Jesus Christ was born that Christmas night that we might have light and life and peace. Oh, as you sang the song this Christmas season, Silent Night, remember our Redeemer was born. He brought light into the world and he heals the broken heart. We celebrate, hark the herald angels sang. We celebrate with Silent Night. We remember the song of Mary, the prophecy in song of Zechariah the words of the angels as they came to visit the shepherds in the field. And together we sang, Peace on Earth, Good Will to Men. Father, as we pause with only a week before Christmas, we align our heart to heaven. We align our spirit to that night where the Messiah, our Savior, was born. Oh, fill each heart with healing and peace, I pray in Jesus' name. You be blessed today as you celebrate and worship in church this morning.